Yeah, Ben and Sarah, those efforts are twofold. So for one, they want people to donate right now during the holidays, but there's also a bigger push on Capitol Hill to increase those donations in the future. In a state where an estimated one in nine people face hunger, the busiest time of the year, the holidays. Our goal this year is to collect and distribute 50,000 Thanksgiving meals. Connecticut food share stocks pantries across the state, but isn't immune to inflation. Jason Jakubowski is president and CEO. And we're also out in the market purchasing food at, at wholesale, and that food has gone up. Here is the dirty little secret of American consumership. 35% of all the food in the United States of America is wasted. From farms to grocery stores and restaurants, Senator Richard Blumenthal wants to encourage more donations. He greeted volunteers at Food Share's Wallingford headquarters Friday to tout legislation that will do just that. The Food Donation Improvement Act would protect businesses from liability should someone get sick from eating donated food. Blumenthal is a lead sponsor of the bill. He says many items remain edible well past sell-by dates. If they simply toss it, it goes into landfills where it produces methane, which contaminates the atmosphere. So this kind of proposal is a win-win. And this bill is just in the proposal stage right now. It has not been taken up by the Senate. But if you are interested in donating food this holiday season, just head to Fox61.com. I'm Samaya Hernandez, Fox 61 News.